Good morning owners and Michael Costa racing fans. Uh, we didn't record a show this week. I've been away in Bundaberg for a few days and we didn't have any runners to review last week. So just a quick little preview today. Three runners up there at Doombin. Uh, we kick off with Seen Too Many, the Mighty Mare. Uh, look, she's uh, looks like she has dowed off a little bit into the prep. So we stepped her up to 2000 now, which should suit. Uh, the only concern for me is the two weeks between runs. She does like to keep very, very fresh, but I have trained her that way. Uh, does look a winnable race, but she's going to have to continue to improve. I uh, wouldn't mind her a little bit juicier odds, but uh, it is what it is. So hopefully she's a she's a good each way chance there today. Uh, we then have the catch. He's uh, He's been a new horse to the stable, which has done really well in his first three starts. But uh, look, he's coming from country grade now into town and he's uh and his favorite so look i thought he would have been a little bit a uh, little bit bigger in the odds but he should get a gun running transit from the inside gate and uh, should get the sweet spot there and should appreciate the increase in distance his work on tuesday probably wasn't as good as sharp as it's been but we're just hoping that he's dowed off into the prep uh, as I said, he's got to take the big jump, but he's got uh, takes a fair bit of weight off him from his last start run. And uh, if he can show his turn of foot that he's been showing in, in track work uh, previously and in his races, he should be in the mix today. But you never know, stepping up from country level into, into town. Finally, we have Willow Tito. She ran really well down there at Grafton. They just out sprinted her a little bit. and uh, But she's come into a benchmark 85 race, which is probably firmer than you'd think uh, this time of this time of year so look uh, she's gonna have to step up her work on Tuesday probably wasn't as sharp either uh, so we're just hoping she can bounce back uh, as as well so I probably think the best place one I'm gonna back uh, the catch to uh, to step up to the grade I think if you can get each way odds about him he's probably probably the play and uh, seen too many I'd probably think she's in the in the same category so that's them. Uh, ratings. Uh, look at the Gold Coast quickly. Race run, one, Green Kudos. It looks like the top rater there. It's a 900 metre race. I don't really like punning in those races, but um, it does look the one on top. Probably the one to watch would be I'll Tell You Now. It's a, it's a first starter. Uh, race five, Alora Enzo. Looks like the top rater there. And race eight, Adelaide's Diamond, if it's wet enough. Uh, loves the wet ladder horse uh, from Brazen Force. So they're the ones at the Gold Coast. Um, maybe Sunshine Coast race one eloquently if it did run there. Um, not too sure where it's running um, as I record this little piece now. So good luck, everyone. We'll be back with the full show next week and uh, have a good weekend.